If you're a Tesla owner, you probably woke up this morning with uh, no signal and uh, really no traffic or, or radio or anything on your Model S or X. So I did uh, find out that there is a nationwide problem and there is a quick fix provided that you have a somewhat modern cell phone plan. Um, you can use your hotspot. Uh, if your car hasn't been built in the last maybe 60 days or so, you'll want to switch it to 2.4 gigahertz. And uh, the only the older cars can only do 2.4, can't do 5. And you can uh, turn your hotspot on and connect to it that way. Although what you may have also noticed is you may have tried that and then found out that when you connect to it, it shuts off as soon as you put your car in drive. So the, the way around this is to just put the car in drive uh, while you're stationary and just have it on hold. And then you can select your hotspot. And then as soon as the hotspot connects, you'll get, um, you'll get confirmation here. The signal bars will go away, be replaced with Wi-Fi. Your stations and everything will come back and you can take it off hold and back into drive and you'll see that uh, you you'll stay connected while you're driving if you do put it into park uh, the second that you put it back into drive again you'll notice that it disconnects so it's literally just keeping it in drive and then as soon as you've got it into drive and connect your hotspot this will uh, be a temporary fix for everybody until they actually fix this but Hopefully that helps. Uh, also, I noticed that I didn't get this uh, set up on my commute and autopilot was super duper squirrely. I'm not sure if that's just a, <laughs> a today thing or if it has something to do with the LTE connection, but if you are using autopilot a ton today, uh, just keep a, you know an extra sharp eye on the road. And I'll talk to you guys later.